viewers to the subscribers welcome back to meds bathroom but to like share and subscribe to the channel as we bring you a few things that take place in a ja so right about now people we have an ex-policeman was shot dead and three others person were injured during an attack by gunmen in Caymanas garden st catherine late monday deceased has been identified as danavan mclean a 33 year old businessman and ex-member of a jamaica constabulary force report are that danavan and a group of people were at a car wash when a toyota axia motor car drove up and stopped then three men armed with handgun alighted and opened gunfire at them the shooter then escaped in the motor vehicle the police was summoned and upon the arrival the wounded mclean and three other injured men were found they were taken to a hospital where Donovan was pronounced dead and the other three were admitted. So we move right on into the parish of St. Anne. So we get to realize so when Anna got a cow. So two men were chopped to death by a mob in what town St. Anne and Monday have been identified. They are 28 year old Demar Rose, a construction shan worker a falmut and 46 year old o'neill robinson a taxi operator of mata Bury, both in chulani mm -hmm. about 9 30 a.m rose and robinson were traveling in a gray voxy minibus along with men in a black axia motor car they were allegedly went into the district to stole and kill one cow and eight goats and then place the carcasses in the vaccine minibus. Police report that citizens saw what happened and raised an alarm. Further report revealed that the resident blocked the main thoroughfare in a bid to accost the men. But her alleged attack with handguns by the men in the Axiom motor car who then managed to escape. A car then to cops the vaxi bus in which Rose and Robinson were traveling developed mechanical problem. Mm -hmm. It ID alleged that the accused thief exit the vehicle with machete and were beaten and chopped by the residents. The police were summoned and Rose and Robinson were taken to hospital where they were pronounced dead.